here what's good cryptocurrency fans out there welcome back to the everything altcoin channel today we're going to be talking about the big news that recently came out and give you guys some polka dot alpha that is coming out as well right now before we get into talking about all of that i would like to ask you guys to subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already we're on the road to 20k subscribers so if you guys want to help out with that hit that red subscribe button don't forget to like the video comment what you think about this partnership and what this means for the future of cardano and polka dot in the comment section down below and while you're down there join that discord by hitting that link in the comment section down below and you guys are able to ask all your questions on how to get into the private cells that we get into with the patreon group here because we're getting into a lot of big ones i've seen recently you guys are all asking how to get into shrapnel and things like that we already closed that deal already we got into shrapnel's private cell so this is the time where you want you guys want to get in because you guys are going to be missing out on some of the biggest sales that we're going to be getting right and that bull market is coming near we're getting closer and closer to that bull market and a lot of these altcoins are going to be coming out in that dgen market so you guys do not want to miss out on that so let's get right into the video guys first why do they have to do charles like this man <laughs> why do they have to do charles like this talking about he connecting himself to the polka dot sdk this is crazy uh, they attacking this man but on other news essentially with this partnership some people like it some people don't some people are attacking you know cardano or polka dot i don't i don't know why that is um i thought this partnership would actually end tribalism and crypto as you guys are seeing the two biggest two of the biggest blockchains actually partnering with each other one is using the other to you know benefit their technology interoperability is the future guys we all the blockchains to actually be able to speak to each other right this is the future this is how i started the channel this was why i was a fan of polka dot in so many ways right interoperability is the future and with this little partnership this shows that interoperability is key cardano is up 34 percent uh not 34 percent sorry is up 4.9 percent sitting at 34 cents at 11.9 billion dollar market cap that is very good here right if you guys scroll down his all-time high was three dollars and nine cents I want to know do you guys think that cardano could make its way back to his all-time high let me know in the comment section down below but let's get right into the topic so a few days ago you know the input output uh twitter page x page put out this partner chains are the next frontier for cardano's evolution iog unveils a revolutionary framework enabling independent interoperable layer one blockchain networks to thrive so goku here puts out an in-depth thread on what's in that article and breaks down everything and gives you guys some crazy insight on this one whole thread a lot of alpha has been given in this one thread that we're going to go over here so cardano has announced its use of polka dot tech stack for partner chains in short cardano is going for side chains to enhance scalability and enable interoperability between specialized blockchains leveraging its liquidity and security so you guys know cardano has been working hard for a long time right charles been trying to make cardano that thing but after four years of research they opted to re not reinvent the wheel for the framework instead they decided to go with polka dots sdk formerly substrate for the leading modular and flexible design for interoperable future now he gave the first spotlight right midnight network is likely likely to be the first adopter of these partner chains with a ceo who has roots back from priority tech coincidence so midnight is a new blockchain a regulation friendly blockchain and easy to use platform for developing and running decentralized application let's just quickly scroll through their website here and show you guys their team essentially right midnight well data is created at an exponential rate as people and companies interact with the digital world today's apps and machines have access to sensitive and confidential data which are value uh, vulnerable to leaks and hacks harming both organizations and individuals but as you guys can see the team for midnight here is public you guys can go ahead and look into their backgrounds and what they're building here but the alpha does not stop there right why is this good for cardanos this is this is beneficial for you guys rebuilding standards and frameworks from scratch you're welcome to a modular interoperable paradigm with best available flexible robust battle-tested stack tech so the same tech has already been used in by aval project here we're going to quickly look into this it's a modular da solution blockchain for rollup founded by polka dots co uh, not polka dots sorry polygons co-founder now the interop uh, interop podcast already has covered these guys right 
Um, AVOL is a highly decentralized data availability designed to meet the need of next gen trust, minimize applications and sovereign roll up. Quickly heading over to their website, you guys can see, you guys can go look over their roadmap and you can actually test out their test net there. So with AVOL, you can build better blockchains, right? More easier than ever. Easy to use, scalable. You got trust minimized, secure, flexible, efficient and future ready so this is going to be something we're going to have to really look into here all right it's a lot of things going into it i'm not going too in depth in this video on these new blockchains because i don't want to make it too long for you guys now the part that excites me the most is this next part here Modera starknet utilizes polka dot sdk to enhance ethereum with zk layer two and three advancements guys this is an ethereum layer two using polka dots sdk to actually enhance ethereum and you guys said polka dot is dead you guys said polka dot is terrible now if you guys already don't know about starknet i think i made a video which i'm going to leave in the cards up top for you guys they're potentially doing an airdrop as well as a new layer two that is actually looking pretty good you guys already know there's been a lot of different layer twos coming out right so a quick introduction into the moderate starknet the open source Starknet sequencer. Moderate is an open source Starknet sequencer built using Substrate as a sequencer. Moderate plays a crucial role in the architecture of Starknet by processing transactions and generating block. On Starknet, the sequencer takes transactions from the users and executes them on the layer two network using Cairo Virtual Machine. It creates blocks that are later proven valid uh valid by the prover component Modera aims to mimic the behavior of the public starknet uh starknet mainnet this means devs can use Modera to run starknet smart contracts just as if they were de uh, deployed on a live network essentially this is just think of it as the testnet to starknet right Modera can also be used to build custom starknet applications that settle on ethereum actually giving it that kind of kusama vibe as well now, if you guys are big fans of naruto you guys already like modera um the modera test net here this thing looks fire <laughs> i'm just such a, like everyone was a big fan of modera but you guys can scroll down here and get a quick idea looking to do so with this roadmap you guys can see compatibility with public starknet right deploy your starknet app chains easily these are all what's coming soon uh proven data availability performance that's all right there in their roadmap and there's a little bit more you guys can go ahead and read everything that is being built on Modera. So he also gave a bunch of reasons on why they chose um, Polkadot's SDK, especially why they chose Polkadot's SDK over the Cosmos SDK. But after all that, after seeing all the buzz about block trend, uh, blockchain trends, narratives, and developments, probably yes, it's all just Polkadot. As an adoption of its tech stack grows, the noise increases. Some may revisit the ecosystem, some devs rediscover its tech stack. So a lot of things is coming up for Polkadot. This is huge. I believe this is very huge. Two of the biggest blockchains are kind of uh, working together, right? Ca uh, Cardano partners with Polkadot to use as their SDK. That is huge in my opinion. And I've been telling you, Polkadot is very bullish. Right now, you guys are getting it at favorable prices, but you guys are complaining at the prices that you see it at right now. This, you're not going to see this going into the bull market. $4, just a few just my last video, I think we saw Polkadot around under $4. Now it's at $484, about to hit $5 soon. You guys, this is cheap prices you're going to see for Polkadot as of right now. I told you guys my price prediction. I do think we go 2x from its previous all-time high, putting at about $100, right? I think that is very doable in that next bull market, but a lot of people don't think so. But here's a little bit more things that is happening in the Polkadot ecosystem. As you guys know that Polkadot is moving to the block space, right? That is coming out very soon here. And I told you guys, pay attention to Elastic, right? As these guys are gonna be the new marketplace for Polkadot when it comes down to buying core time, essentially, right? Right now, Polkadot core time is going to have an awesome marketplace. Look at the codes and documents written so far, right? By these guys, these are the people that created Elastic right now. Um, this is like the marketplace that you guys can actually go ahead and buy, you know, some core time right this is the primary bulk core market and let me go to the next one here next picture here you guys can see a little bit more on what's going on the renewal period and things like that this is what elastic is building i'm telling you guys to follow these guys make sure you pay attention to those guys but with that core time coming into play a lot of people are really 
in favor of burning revenue from core time sales As you guys can see Filippo here has put out a nice little you know a nice little um, thread here not a thread but a tweet here on his opinions on what he wants um, from like basically the core time sales and there's some people that really are agreeing with this right now inflation right now uh, is already below 10% at 7% or am I wrong he says inflation is still at 10% currently 7.5 goes to the network participants and the 2% 2.5% goes to the Treasury right mellow yellow here says long way of just saying burn equals good right this is what people want to see burning in the uh, burning of the the dilution of polka dot essentially right but this is not just it though a new chain is building on polka dot the mandela chain will likely be the first substrate based chain possibly a polka dot pair chain in, in in indonesia backed by government to issue national ids and university degree cert uh, certificates guys this is huge this is huge on what's coming to polka dot guys you guys got to pay attention to that polka dot ecosystem this alpha i just gave you a bunch of alpha in this entire video but let's end it off by just telling you guys some miscon you know clearing up some misconceptions of polka dot filippo put this out comparing polka dots on chain metrics to other protocol is like comparing apples with elephants polka dot is a layer zero and it has been designed to be efficient as possible it tasks to secure layer ones and provide secure interoperability to them that's it polka dot is not a company i guess that's probably why the sec hasn't gone for them right it is a protocol polka dot has no ceo that is why gavin would step down right it is not a legal entity the success of polka dot is not tied to the success of any company but rather to what gets built on top of it and, and institutional adoption polka dot has 50 layer one chains but there will always be projects that will leave and come to polka dot again that is the nature of the process as our network is not leaving polka dot people thought they was leaving polka dot because they did the whole um, polygon sdk uh, not polygon sdk zkz evm i told you guys they're not leaving polka dot right they just renewed their slot and composable fin will do the same as well so a lot of exciting things is coming from polka dot guys i want you guys to pay attention to polka dot but i do want to know give me all the hate on what you guys got on polka dot because i love reading them it's just funny to read them because i know within a few months or so when that bull market comes back around i can highlight some of these comments and be like what did you say let me know in the comment section down below we on the road to 20k subscribers so if you guys want to help out with that hit that red subscribe button and i'll check you guys later peace you too